Having a healthy uh, yeast and enough of it is crucial for making great beer. You need 11 grams of healthy dried yeast to uh, have enough mass of yeast to get in there and do its job. If your yeast is working really well and it's healthy, uh, the bugs and, and bacteria won't be able to get in there and take hold and impact on your beer's quality. So you need to make sure that you've got a, a premium brewing yeast, you've got a, over 11 grams of it, it's within its uh, expiry date. The first thing we need to do is hydrate it properly. There's a couple of simple steps to this. First you boil your kettle and you let it cool down to 95 to 105 degrees Fahrenheit or between 35 and 40 degrees uh, Celsius. Just make sure it's the right temperature, use a thermometer. Clean and sanitise a glass and some scissors. Pour around 200 millilitres or just under a cup of uh, the boiled water into the glass. Stick your, your cleaned and sanitised thermometer in there. Cover with some plastic wrap, which is uh, you've given a quick spray. When it's down to the correct temperature range, take a yeast packet, cut it open and pour the contents on top of the water. Leave it for 15 minutes, give it a swirl around to, to mix it through, leave for another 15 minutes and what you'll see is a large creamy head which, is, uh, which has come up. This is an indicator that the yeast you've got is really healthy. What you can do is once you've cleaned everything, start working on your yeast uh, and then put together the rest of your brew. If this doesn't happen and the yeast uh, doesn't look like it's doing anything at all, it's probably unviable and it's, uh, all the cells are dead.